Hello, my beautiful Capricorns. Welcome to July readings. July energy loves who is coming towards you and their genuine intentions. As a general reading, loves might resonate with you. Sometimes might feel like even as a personal reading, and sometimes might not make much sense. Take it accordingly, and of course, let's not be judging. Capricorn, who is coming towards you? Usually we used to do who or what, but this month deciding to do just who is coming, which that means what person is on the way to you. What's coming, we'll do a little later in a separate reading. Trying to do as much personalized or as much clear messages for all of you. This person could be a new person, could be um, an ex, could be a work person, could be, um, could be a family member. But I feel here there is um, an offer coming in for you from someone already. Or someone here is already ready. Let's see, darlings. The Knight of Cups jumped. If it's coming again see it for some of you could come more than one person I have the five of wands five of wands usually speaks that a few people definitely are interested in you or a lot of people want to to know more about you I also hear that people talk about you and some talk what they know and what they don't page of pentacles I don't feel here you are very much interested in what the people talk or what they say the devil judgment justice seven of wands Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords, Nine of Wands. So it seems here with someone you could have a history. It's like you don't want to do anything here about some someone or some kind of situation here. Three of Cups. What's going on, loves? And Four of Pentacles. There's someone here who wants your friendship back. Or wants you back. I don't I don't see much cups here besides this three of cups. But somebody here it's very very insistent. It's very pursuing. It's a darlings. Could be a person who who could uh, gossip a lot about you, who said a lot of things about you. For some of you, this what I'm hearing. It's someone you know, but. It's kind of I rather be careful about this person because everything what comes from them comes with a price. Okay, two of wands, knight of cups. So here is the knight of cups again. So that's mean definitely somebody here has an offer. Could be a water sign. Yeah, this person comes with an apology. I don't feel this is a love energy here, loves. I don't see love. I see more like a friendship or a person you know or at one point you, you've you been good friends or a family friend or something like that. For some of you, it could be your mother or your father. 
whoever they are is why they are so insistent because you are not really into this person's like they better not they want to talk to you i feel here they are definitely want to talk or they are gonna send you a message this person is keeping an eye on you i i'm hearing they could talk certain things behind your back or this person always has something to say Okay, let's see. Who is this person? You definitely ended, could be a Scorpio. You definitely ended the connection between you. You two, you are very different from each other. Or they could be all about gossip. You are not at all into that. They could be looking very great or they could have a very great looking person. But you you feel here that this person is never going to change. Even though they promise. I don't see love again. For some of you could be friends with benefits at one point. But I don't see love. It's like with this person is is never gonna be a stable commitment or a stable connection or this person is not stable could be stable emotionally mentally physically whatever yeah for some of you you've been involved with this person on a physical level they are very good looking don't get me wrong they are very good looking for some of you, yes, you've been involved with them, but no more. You, you kind of feel like like this person could got under your skin. So that's kind of person. Okay, what's their intentions? Or they decide to win you back. What's their intentions? Let's see. Ten of Cups. They feel like only you can make them happy. On all levels. They also feel like you are Twin Flames. Strength. Could have a Leo in the chart. Could be a Leo. Four of Swords. Three of Pentacles. So their intention is to work things out with you. Will they actually do this? Because once you want once you to want something, are you actually gonna do it? Will they actually do it? Chariot. They are very determined. Six of Cups. Ace of Cups. And the Hangman. And Five of Pentacles. So, they want to do it because they... They don't see other ways or other better ways. Eight of Wands. They don't want to to be in the the position they are right now. Why is telling me here that this person really is into, they are good, they need to look good, they, there's something here about this person, sexuality, it, it's incredible. 
yeah oh yeah this person it's it's kind of like they never experienced with anyone what they experienced with you okay how about you darlings High Priestess, Four of Pentacles, you are not, you don't want to talk with them, kind of. It's like you are not into them or something here is like, I don't know if this is going to work out or we can go back together. King of Wands. Queen of Pentacles. Again, there's something here about they are their sexuality, their body, their money, things like that. You you kind of not trusting them. Or you feel like yeah, this person comes with a big price. It's like you you want to believe, but not quite sure if that's gonna happen. You don't wanna get hurt again. Okay, is these things are uh, gonna happen for long term or not? why this person feels like so possessive or they they might be around people like you are my and i do whatever i want with you there's something here like oof king of swords tower ten of wands it's kind of like they need to They need to come with a different perspective. And then I'll choose how to. Yeah, it's kind of, you definitely know this person. It's kind of a, a problematic. Why this person, um, their attitude, it's, you, you don't like the attitude or they are, um, they are ways. It's like they are way too full of themselves. It's kind of the love is not enough. Or just to care is not enough. So... It's like this person, their personality, it's, it's, yeah, it's strong, but for some of you even ask like how in the, in the first place or how in the earth I, I got to this person. Because this person, it's, I don't know, it's a macho man or how you call the girls. Because they always seek attention. It's a seek attention person. And you can't stand that. You are not into those things. And that's the, the biggest issue here. What advice we have from, from spirit to you, loves? Who is this person, Capricorn? Advice, we have five of swords, magician, two of pentacles, and the sun. The advice is keep the things simple. Eight of wands. Communication is the key. And somebody here is kind of inhibited. This person is very untraditional. 
If they want to go naked, they will go naked. There's something here about this person. They have no inhibitions. Or... It's like one of you... have this, others don't. But it's kind of like your differences, if you can work on your differences, this connection could go to the distance. Otherwise, let it go, darlings. It's a very, it's like one of those karmic connections that you you can't leave, but at the same time, you you don't want to leave. So, and yes, Spirit says, the universe brought you together to work on this big, huge differences between you two. If not, you know what to do. So Capricorn, wow. And it's kind of, even though there are the people there, nobody will have the access to come in unless you will end this connection for good. If that's going to happen. Otherwise, it's in circles. Goodness. So loves... Take care of you and always, always make the best decisions best suited for you. See you, darlings. Bye for now.